So for <coughs> breakfast, we have once again oatmeal with bananas and soy milk. So today is not soy milk, it's like this oat milk with almonds in it. Which tastes pretty good, but it's like really, really sweet. And we also have this. What Thailand is really famous for is this vegetable um, rice. And we also have a lot of fruit like apples and kiwis and peaches. We have dragon fruit. Look at that. It's such a big and fresh and beautiful dragon fruit. And it's like really, really juicy. However, the juice is like a stain. If it gets on anywhere, it doesn't come off like ever. This is like so soft and it's like so pink to the point that it's kind of neon pink purple -ish. it's amazing an hour after breakfast we're having our first snack of the day which is um this kind of cake style thing Vegetarian. And here's some old infrastructure that we're visiting. Um, the building itself is not actually old, it's probably only like 20 years old or 10 years old. But um, the style they used was not a really modern style, it was um, designed after the, uh, the building styles in the Chinese Renaissance. And this is the temple that was built to celebrate um, the Asian Chinese philosopher Con Confucius. So this place is the center point of Tainan. Um, the whole city style, like in accordance to like the roads and stuff is a lot like in Paris. There's like this one big center and this is it. So we're at the oldest department store in China. And it's just recently been done. finish this for breakfast. We're having it right now to snack. Not even an hour after we had our first snack because we like to eat a lot. We went out and got Thailand's finest street foods. So we have oh like fun, these. Huh? Dumpling fun, style fun, soup. Fun. But it's such a little humor. And they have noodles. And egg. And more soup. <laughs> and there we go. We got this um kind of pancake like thing, but it's like super thick, kind of stuff. with taro and over there it's stuffed with 
red bean. And this whole thing, hey the Tumble Tumble.